Uh, hey, before we go into this video, I just want to really tell you guys, please subscribe to my channel. It comes to my notice that, unfortunately, only 25% of the people who watch my stuff are subscribed. So if you are, and please consider if you want to see more really dumb stuff from me, right? Take care, guys. Alright, what's up, guys? As always, welcome back to another week with Ferret. And it's been some time since I've uploaded and been able to record... Work has been really tough, uh, but also um, the the tools that have been used for getting has not worked uh, since of all updates. So I'm kind of glad to get back to this, and even more so going up against a team that really doesn't look on paper all that scary. I mean, it would be a lie saying that it wasn't because I think Jarados ruins me naturally. Um, we have Tabasco, though, so I'm not incredibly worried. I mean, this is what it's all about, after all. Yeah, let's let's start off with that. I have every reason to think his best leads are... Well, either Fretress to get spikes up early, or Ambipom. If Ambipom is the lead, it's fine. It's it's problematic, to say the least, but I think I can deal with it. Yeah, Fretress, nice. So hopefully we get some good use of Tabasco. <laughs> Love that name. <laughs> I'm gonna frisk his leftovers. Um, yeah, like the, it had any other sets. Anyway, you're gonna go for flamethrower because that's what we do. I wonder what he thinks I can do. He can always explode though. Like I don't believe a flamethrower should even bring him down to range. Um, I'll happily take it though. Let's see, Flare flareless will do what? At least over half, right? Ooh, nice, <laughs> sturdy. Pff, please. All right, so let's see, and he'll go for a layer of spikes. He got for a layer of spikes. As if we know he has leftovers, which means we will not have to worry about any surprise Custa theory. And uh, that could be great. Honestly, I mean, he clearly want a sack play here. Right? That's what you want to do. I don't believe U-turn is a kill, so I'll keep playing for yeah, no, no reason trying to save it. And Ferret gets an absolute KO, which is exactly what we wanted. I mean, everything from here is just fine. <laughs> but the spike's gonna be annoying. So I think he got a good turn out of it. He, I mean, Ferret Res is used to, you know, get as much hasses as possible. So I mitigated some of it, but definitely not all of it. Just wondering what could be his switching. Stormlight. Alright, Sableye. Yeah. Prankster Will-O-Wisp. Not something I'm worried about. There we go. It will, you know, screw up my, um... Well, double edges, but at the same time, I mean, I get some... Get some nice momentum, which is all I want anyway. Um, question is... Do you have a good switch in for this? I wish I could have had a fairy. Or, I mean, in theory, I think I got it. But I don't want to take to that much pressure off. Jujimbo could be nice. Really can't do anything to him, though I can't do anything to him either. And, uh, ooh, yeah. I guess this is it. I, for the life of me, can't remember his mons. And I think that's going to be very problematic. I remember he had two steel types, and since I killed one of them, it kind of falls in between. Um, we know we have um, Empoleon. And, of course, the Sableye, which will be slightly annoying. Hmm. I wonder, should I even risk that Will-O-Wisp? It really stinks. Keeps going for it. Kind of nice, he missed it. Specs Volt Switch, though. Didn't do nearly enough because I'm Life Orb. That's, that's right. I remember. All right. Um, with that said, I think I'm bringing Stami. Because his best play should be Recover, right? And since I'm non-invested, I don't believe I'm that scary. I have a choice banded Garcha, but I really, I really can't pull it off. <laughs> so right, 
half expecting um, to recover. Yeah, nothing to it. And since I'm analytic, this is going to get boosted after all. I just, since I have no real investment, it's going to do something, but definitely not too much. Nice, there we go. So as long as he decides to go first, my skull will do a lot. This is a complete lockdown. I couldn't, can't believe I'm having it. I gotta speed this up. Huh. Just my best options are not able to dent it in a way I want to. Sculling again. Confused, right? Oh, it's a full-on annoyer. That's, that's problematic. Just break through once, Stommy. Just once. Shame. Alright, so I pretty much need Raichu. Ah, oh, this is the worst. What, like we played 5 minutes, I have 15 minutes to figure this out? Not a position I want to be in. Damn it. That's why you bring a fairy type. That's definitely why you bring a fairy type for sure. Right? Knock off. Ah, it's bad. That's bad. Dude, kind of want to speed this up. Really kind of wanted to. That's right. One Thunderbolt. You probably should recover. Um, Will of Wisp, nothing to it. This is so bad. I need a crit or something like that. Um, or right now, I clearly like uh, my best play is Vol Switch out and uh, on his recover. And bring in more while for play rough. Because he will recover more than I can dent him to, but he has to make a decision whether or not he wanna burn me or um, um burn me or trying to um, try to re recover basically. I think play rough with Chia Four should dent him, but I also know if he decides to burn me, I guarantee take him out. So it's I like this scenario for all the wrong reasons. By the way, that knockoff did a lot considering he was burned. Huh. Did not want to think about that too much. Let's see what he wants to do. This is a tough call for him. Yeah, switching out probably is a stronger play. Goes into... Kinguin. Yeah, that's the penguin, isn't it? Player up is gonna do nothing. Actually, they're alright. <laughs> I'm surprised it did that much. Um, hmm. All right. Yeah, I'm not feeling this. I'm. I usually try to engorge myself in momentum, and I get nothing of it. It's not gonna do anything. Question is Should we retaliate with a skull here? Just in case he tries to bring in the sable eye. Stormlight. Is then a little boosted? Please tell me I got this right. Yes! Right? Right? Yes! Now I can spin. <laughs> Hell yeah. Got it. By the way, um, if you're wondering why I'm not too screaming about me, it's because I have my daughter in the other room, so I'm trying to uh, record while, you know, keeping the family intact. And oh, Will Smith. He's gonna slap me, isn't he? Haha! <laughs> Got the joke. <laughs> That's awful. Question is, it's a double slap. 
just keep on U-turn. That's a good play, actually. Didn't think about that. Oh, Life Orb. Hopefully I can use something with that. Sorry, we have Abipom. We have Empoleon. We no longer have a Steel or Sableye, so let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He has a Nidoking. I remember. I don't think Nidoking can do too much, though. I can definitely set up spikes against it. Yeah, no, nope, that's not happening, brah. It's not happening. You are not a switching, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're a lot, but not a switching. I mean, his best play could be Ice Beam, for sure. And it should definitely do something with Share Force. But uh, I can stay in and just see what it's all about. Plus, with Pain Split, I'm kinda half annoying. Right, switches out, goes into Kinguin. Love that name, that's a great name for it. Fire Blast, ooh, that's bad. Um, damn, I really wanted Tubasco to do stuff. Or, it, in, in theory, it did, actually. Sorry, I don't want to see Defog. We've already seen Skull. Um, could just as well be a Stealth Rock set. Or it could be a DLC set, which if so, then we have another problem. I don't believe um, Grass not do all too much, but it's still annoying. And my opponent is thinking, so I'm, I'm glad for that. That means that it's not a scenario it was designed about. But it stayed in, because I'm definitely slower. Come on, Stormy, I need you to spin on this, if possible. Skull, yeah. Still does a lot, though. I mean, my retaliation is definitely not up there. The only trait I got in benefit here is that I can recover versus this. But that also means that this becomes a stalemate, which is something I do kind of want to avoid. But I don't want to avoid Rapid Spin, that's for sure. They usually tend to carry, like, Scald, Ice Beam, or Grass Knot. Let's see. All right, Yardos. It's Intimidate, so that's good, I think. So no more spikes, that works. That should be faster twice, basically. Right, we're psychic here, do as much damage as possible. I'm just glad it's not Moxie, basically, but I shouldn't be able to do all too much. Ooh, crunch! That's bad. <laughs> I like my reaction, like, whoops, that's not it. Okay. But, I mean, I have a perk here. I can easily Volt Switch versus this and avoid the burn completely. So it's all depending on whether or not you want to sax this. That was a good play actually from my opponent, honestly. Right, brings in... Oh yeah, I'm an idiot, of course, I remember. And no more Toxic Spikes. Ooh, ah, that's bad. Right, surf this up. I want the big boy damage. I really do. Ooh, yeah, that's good. Retail with an earth power, flame for her. Yeah, works just as well, really. Sora right you. Holy Sora might. Um Question is. Like, my easy play is bringing this in and hurt stuff. Bringing Chubasco, I'm kind of sure I'm, I'm screwing myself over. Do that with him, too. Alright. If 
Barb Lassen. Like, I don't want to put myself in a scenario where I try to wrap up with, um, with Garchomp, but I know I'm there. <laughs> if you kind of catch my drift. So we'll see what I do. Um... I kind of want to set up Toxic Spikes versus this, but at the same time, there aren't really that many mons left that benefit from it. Like, Nidoking King takes it away. Um, immune, immunity in um, King Win, back again. Come on, we need this Fire Blast to land this time. Nice. Well done, Weezing. did absolutely nothing. Um... Yeah, it really did nothing, didn't it? Still need to keep this guy alive somehow. Right, Tubasco, let's do this. I need to will it out this guy. Gonna frisk Shookaberry. Alright, he had rocks, that's awful. Let's see. Did I screw myself over or not? Just a little bit. The burn would be nice. Alright, can I live that? Pfft, no. Okay, come on, buddy. Come on. Let's think about this. Let's think about this. Don't want to make that play. But this play makes no sense. Alright. Oh, come on. Don't burn me. Like I said, I just need him whittled down. Less. Yes. Nice. Because I want to save my Jujimbo or my... Ah. Alright, it, it all becomes a Bowser Guard Chomp. I, I kind of hope it, it never would be. Um. But yeah, this is it. Like, lock myself in Doubt Rage, take this guy out, take whatever guys there are left, and um, take it from there. Wow, Gyros, big boy play. Did not expect that. That's right, we take him out, nothing to it, minus one. Pfft, please. I'm a fucking guard jump, mate. Get the hell out of here, fake ass dragon. So that should be followed up with, what, the Abbey Farm, right? The Will Smith. Or Smite, in this, in this scenario. Right, Fake Out. Completely block me. Rough Skin is gonna be just about that. And his Life Orb. Flinched and couldn't move and confused. That looks about right. Okay, here's what things is kind of weird. The best play should be double slap for sure. Dual shop, as that's grander. And I really have no good play besides Sludge Bomb or Lee Jones. He can win the timer. I really hope it doesn't make that play though. Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna lose the timer. Kinda kinda need to open on scold. 
Oh, I'm losing this game. But I just, I can't stall it out. I can't. Don't get burned, buddy. Nice. <laughs> Gonna get myself some big boy plays. But it won't matter. Every opponent is gonna absolutely get the last laugh. I was kind of thinking maybe I just should double switch and get Chomp back. But the Will Smith is just doing what he does best. Just slaps me silly. I feel like a Chris Rock right now. I'm just gonna get myself punished. Badly, boy. Badly. Alright, let's see if we can get. If we can get one more play in. Come on, 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 come on. Come on, Jijimbo. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Do the move. Do the move. Come on, buddy. Come on. He withdraws. What a... Absolute mad lad. Oh, yeah. So... If the timer wasn't here, I would have won this game. He can't beat... He can't beat Weezing. Ah, it's a shame. Well, really... GG, what a what a cool game. <laughs> Bit on the stolly side, didn't have the muscles in me to kinda of break the team apart, so to my opponent MNL, very much GG, well done. Everyone's watching, I hope you enjoyed this game, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care of one right.